play game now, my friends, entitled World's Worst. This is for all four performers, so gentlemen, come on down. These guys are divided into two pairs. Ryan and Colin are over there, and Gary and Wayne are here. This is a quick fire game in which each performer has to come up with as many examples as possible of the world's worst thing to say or do in a hospital. Enjoy. I'm <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> All right, let's put it in the books. Operation completed at, uh... <laughs> Normally, I'd use tools to cut you open and suck out the cellulite, but oh well. <laughs> All right. See by your x-ray here that you've swallowed a light bulb. <laughs> oh. oh, no, you're fine. Eek. Oh. <laughs> Eek. Oh. <laughs> I realize, Mr. Patient, that normally the tonsillectomy wouldn't go this way, but I like to go the long way around. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just preparing you for surgery. <laughs> That's 50 cc's for you, 50 cc's for me. Try the mouth. Oh. <laughs> yes. Points to all of you for, uh, for what I thought was some excellent surgical work. What did we get the points for? What did you say? Excellent surgical work. Oh, I thought you said excellent circle jerk. <laughs> that is bad to say in the hospital. Yeah, that's horrible. That would be a terrible thing to say in a hospital, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent circle joke. Good job. We, we're going to play a game now that is entitled Duet. This game is for Wayne and Gary, accompanied by Laura Hall and Linda Taylor. Uh, Here to join them is our celebrity guest, so please welcome one of the stars of the hit CW show, I Zombie, Mr. Malcolm Goodwin. Malcolm Goodwin! Yay! Malcolm. Here we are. Here we are. All right. So, Wayne and Gary are going to be singing a song all about Malcolm and you'll be singing in the style of party music, so whenever you're ready, <laughs> Sounds of Blackness, take it away. <laughs> sounds of Blackness. <laughs> this is the most black people that have ever been on one stage, this on this one, show. Two, three, I mean... Legally, we probably got to move to another network. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, yeah. take it away. Uh -huh. All right, so on TV, yes. you work with a zombie, the zombie's all around. Let's say that the three of us are going into a zombie club. Okay. What's your best zombie girl pickup line? Um, you want some brains? You want some brains. You want some brains. You want some brains. You want some brains. All right, so that's the pickup line. Hit it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. There's a girl right there. She's dead. There's a girl right there, all right. There's a girl right there with a the head. But we gonna get some brains tonight. There's a girl right there, don't you know? I can see her corpus luteum. Uh -huh. I cannot stop till I feel her big fat gluteum. Now there's something about a girl that just wants to get ahead. Uh -huh. But there's something even about the girl who happens to be undead. Do you want to feel my brains? Do you want to feel my brains? Come on. Do you want to feel my brains? Feel my brains, bitch, you go inside. Malcolm, tell her. I got some brains. For I got you. some brains for you in my hands. Come on, I'll do that on rhyme. <laughs> He's not see, there's a girl. A few times I can tell him. I don't need that girl to walk or talk. She don't need to walk in cerebellum. All she got to do was just look at me and I offer her a drink. And when she be like, ah, 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 ah. who needs a girl that can think? But she want that brain. Brain. Got that brain. But you never have a good time unless you taste Mama Doodle Oblongata. Oh. 